Hey guys, so today I'm here with an application review. Guys, this is honestly the kind of game that the iPod and iPhone were made for. I'm serious, guys. This is an, um, just an awesome, awesome app. Um, basically, to just sum it up really quickly, it is a game filled with amazing pixel art, but it's a puzzle game based on the accelerometer. Um, guys, I'm not even going to try. I'm just going to show you. I'm just going to show you. So, that's the way to start the game. And then, hang on, let me just pull the camera back just a little bit. Look at this, guys. Is that just awesome? Look at that. Look at the 3D. And believe me, guys, when I tell you this, it does, I can't tell. It might not, it's probably not coming through the camera too well, but guys, the 3D on this game is just, just amazing. Um, so guys, this premise is really simple, although it's done perfectly. Um, basically, what you do is you, um, take a fully accelerometer. If you touch the screen, it just pauses. So we can go ahead and uh, click it again. So um, the whole point of the game is to just get the puzzles right. Um, now, guys, um, basically you just tilt, and you have to get everything to match up right. So as you can see here, <laughs> I'm sorry, guys, the 3D on this game is just so amazing. So let me see here if I can figure this out. Basically, what you do is you need to get everything to sync up right. So I think that may be around it. I'm not so sure I can get this right, guys, because I'm about, there are a hundred levels in the game, and I believe I'm on level 93 or 94. Um, one thing about the game while I'm trying to figure it out, ah, there we go, got it. Okay, oh, I'm on 96. Um, guys, one thing about the game is that, um, I got this last night, okay, so I've been through 96 levels very quickly, especially the first, probably 60 or 70, you can go through, you know, it takes you, it shouldn't take you 30 seconds to get through. Let's try number 97. Okay, here's a, here's a different kind. So if you guys can see here, a very, very cool concept. So basically, we just got to get all these together. Um, there are all these puzzles are very different. So let's see here if we can get it. Eh, we're getting closer. I mm. uh, hope, I'm sorry guys, the camera, because I have to tilt so much. Hopefully, you guys can see pretty good on the camera. There we go, and you can see, 97. Let's go ahead and do one more. See if I can see if we can find one. Here we go, here's another type. And you see here, oh, I almost got there. As you can see here, I mean, guys, the accelerometer and the 3D looks amazing. Oh, there I had it. Almost. And hang on. Oh, I'm so close. There we go. Guys, now, just take a look at this pixel art really quickly. Look at the, I mean, just it's just such great looking. Now, let's see if I can zoom the camera in just a little bit more without it going out of focus. Guys, just look at it. I mean, guys, this is probably one of the best looking apps and one of the most fun apps I've ever played. Um, guys, eBoy Fix Picks is the name, and it just runs a dollar ninety nine in the App Store currently. Guys, I've I saw it literally when I saw this thing, I saw a video of it. I saw about five seconds of the gameplay, and I didn't even wa finish watching the video. I ran over to my iPod, spent two dollars on this application. And I have not regretted it one bit. Um, as you can see, I've almost finished the game, but guys, I mean, it's it's so much fun, and. And, you know, through a hundred levels, I'm, I'm I'm sure they will add more in a later update. But even so, guys, the hundred levels that they include are fantastic. I highly, highly recommend you guys get this game. It is excellent. Just, just so, so cool. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching.